Welcome to my channel RX Sam 2020. Today we discuss about drug name allopurinol. About allopurinol is in the xanthine oxidase inhibitor family of medications. Allopurinol is a medication used to decrease high blood uric acid levels. It is specifically used to prevent gout, prevent specific types of kidney stones and for the high uric acid levels that can occur with chemotherapy. It is taken by mouth or injected into a vein. Medical Uses Chronic Gout Secondary Hyperuricemia Due to cancer chemotherapy, radiation and thiazides or drugs, prevention of uric acid nephropathy. Calcium Renal Lithiasis What is Gout? Gout is a type of arthritis. It occurs when uric acid builds up in blood and causes inflammation in the joints. Types of Gout Acute gout is a painful condition that often affects only one joint. Chronic gout is the repeated episodes of pain and inflammation. More than one joint may be affected. Hyperuricemia occurs when there is too much uric acid in your blood. High uric acid levels can lead to several diseases, including a painful type of arthritis called gout. What is nephropathy? Nephropathy is the deterioration of kidney function. The final stage of nephropathy is called kidney failure, end-stage renal disease or ESRD. According to the CDC, Centers for Disease Control and Prevention, diabetes is the most common cause of ESRD. Drug Interactions those of azothioprine and mercaptopurine should be reduced when administered allopurinol. Probinacid and salicylates enhance urinary excretion of allopurinol. Enhanced activity of oral hypoglycemic agents and anticoagulants. Mechanism of action Allopurinol is a purine analogue it is a structural isomer of hypoxanthine, a naturally occurring purine in the body, and is an inhibitor of the enzyme xanthine oxidase. Xanthine oxidase is responsible for the successive oxidation of hypoxanthine and xanthine, resulting in the production of uric acid, the product of human purine metabolism. In addition to blocking uric acid production, Inhibition of xanthine oxidase causes an increase in hypoxanthine and xanthine. While xanthine cannot be converted to purine ribotides, hypoxanthine can be salvaged to the purine ribotides adenosine and guanosine monophosphates. Increased levels of these ribotides may cause feedback inhibition of amidophosphoribosyl transferase, the first and rate-limiting enzyme of purine biosynthesis. Allopurinol, therefore, decreases uric acid formation and may also inhibit purine synthesis. Frequently Asked Question What causes high uric acid? Most of the time, a high uric acid level occurs when your kidneys don't eliminate uric acid efficiently. Things that may cause this slowdown in the removal of uric acid include rich foods, being overweight, having diabetes, taking certain diuretics, sometimes called water pills, and drinking too much alcohol. What is an alternative to allopurinol? Febaxostat, a novel non-purine selective inhibitor of xanthine oxidase, is a potential alternative to allopurinol for patients with hyperuricemia and gout. Dosage 
Initially 10,000 mg daily maintain 200 to 600 mg daily. Contraindications Children acute gout Special precautions Both allopurinol and uricojurix should not be started during acute of gout. Iron therapy not advised with allopurinol. Renal or hepatic impairment. Maintain adequate fluid intake. Pediatrics reduced dose necessary. Pregnancy should not to be used. Lactation use with caution. Elderly. Reduced dose may be necessary. Long term side effects. Allopurinol is considered an effective, long-term treatment for managing gout. Although it's generally a safe drug, allopurinol may cause some side effects. Skin rash, even a mild skin rash. Fever. Swelling of the face. Enlarged lymph nodes. Blisters. Trouble breathing. Liver damage. Some brand names which are available in market. Alohexyl, Aluron, Alosic, Milurit, Aloril, Procout, Xyloprim, Xyloric, Xyric. Thanks for watching.